We're down to the final two contestants. So the way this works is once a contestant misspells a word in a particular round, the remaining contestant must spell the word correctly in the next round. So we'll take a little bit of a break here, and everybody can get a breather. Wyatt can uh, get a little bit of water over there and take a little breath. And uh, we'll move into the next round. We have some great prizes. Jack is staying up here because we have uh, other awards and other prizes. So we want to make sure that uh, everybody gets their prizes before they leave the stage. Your word is referendum. Could you repeat the word, please? Referendum. I'm sorry, one more time. Referendum. Can you say it for me once? Referenda. Referendum. Oh, can I have the definition, please? The principle or practice of submitting to popular vote a measure passed upon or proposed by a legislative body or by popular initiative. Referendum. Referenda. Referendum. A referendum. R E F R E N D A. Referendum. Your word is a homonym. Your word is cubicle, defined as a small room or compartment, often approximately square in plan. Cubicle. C-U-B-I-C-L-E. Cubicle. Your championship word is genesis. Genesis. G-E-N-E-S-I-S. Congratulations. These are our final three, our top three contestants. And Nicole is our champion, and she will be going uh, to Washington, D.C. to represent our area, and we'll have an expense-paid trip by the Traverse City Record Eagle. Again, I'd like to thank our pronouncer, Wyatt McDonald, and our two judges, Mike Tyree and Judge Rogers, and our spelling bee coordinator, Lisa Bacon, and... Jenny Thomas, also from the Traverse City Record Eagle. Congratulations, and if you'll invite your parents up, we'll get some more pictures.